Hi guys, welcome back to this YouTube channel. My name is Tomi Hade and today I'll show you how to make this braided headband. So let's go into it. So first off, I'll be using these following things. I need my satin, brighter satin, my scissors, my tailor's chuck, measuring tape, my ruler. Then I got this stuffing from one of my hood pillow. So you can go ahead and use whichever one you choose to. So for this, I'm using this. So I went ahead to measure 4 inches wide and 36 inches long for this project. So you need 3 pieces of that, 36 inches long and 4 inches wide. So go ahead and mark that and cut this out. So that's the pieces laid down flat. So the next thing you need to do now is to fold it into two and sew 0 0.25 inches, that is quarter of an inch, all the way down on the three pieces. Now fold it into two in such a way that you have your wrong side facing outward. Then you stitch it quarter of an inch, as I said earlier. So that's it. I've gone ahead to do that. And the next thing for you is to turn them. So I use a pencil to turn them inside out. So after doing that, you can decide to press it. I did press it with an iron of camera. Then the next is to fill it up with the pillow stuffing. So you want to take your time and do that. So please guys, remember to subscribe to this channel. It's free. Please, please support my channel. So that's it. I've gone ahead to fill up the three pieces. So the next thing is to attach them. So you can actually use your needle and thread, but I decided to use my sewing machine to press it. So just join the three things together and have a straight stitch. Then the next is for you to weave. So this is me showing you how to, in case you don't know how to, but obviously I think you should know. <laughs> but anyways, go ahead and weave it like so, all the way down. So for me to hold on to the stitches, I used my needle and thread at the end. Then I went ahead to use the sewing machine later on. So I used the needle and thread to just tack it down. Then I went on to the sewing machine to make a stitch, as you can see. So the next thing you need to do now is cut out the SX, then join the two ends together and Use your um, needle and thread to This small piece is 5 inches by 5 inches. You can decide to use whatever you want, but I wanted something not too big. So for this project, I use 5 inches by 5 inches. So so that 0 0.25, that is quarter of an inch, then place it like so. Then you sew out the excess, then you turn it inside out so as to have the stitches facing inward. Now, in order to avoid it moving up and down, I decided to use this um, glue. So you go ahead and apply the glue on the hedges to secure it. You can get this on Amazon put on the glue to to it so as to avoid it you know moving up and down just to secure that so i open up the edges and and apply the hot glue as you can see and we are almost done practically we are done so guys your braided headband is ready to be one so you can decide to use any fabric for this project. You can use any fabric for this project, as I said earlier. And in case you don't have a hot glue, you can use your needle and thread. Yes, the finished look, guys. It came out well and nice. So please make sure you try yours and leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Till next time. Bye. Thank you.